hi everyone and welcome back to another video um i don't really know what to call this video because it's kind of like a downsizing video but like not really i don't know it's kind of like a reorganizing moment this is already a mess and i just started but <laughs> yeah um i wanted to make a lot of changes in my collection right now so i thought i would just make a video out of it because i thought it could be like a fun like reorganizing moment so i'm gonna make some decisions about my collection today <laughs> and they're not really like downsizing like it all makes sense when i explain but basically i have something in here that i'm gonna be moving a collection into and if you're familiar with the store you probably know what it is so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and open this so literally as soon as i started recording this my eyes decided to start like tearing up and i don't really know why <laughs> like i'm not crying i literally like don't even know it feels like something got in my eyes right now so i'm kind of struggling right now um but it's fine it's all good okay i think I got myself together now. I don't know what just happened to me. But anyway, as you can see here, I may have bought an A5 binder. And actually, I already have an A5 binder. I don't know if I've shown it yet on this channel, but I did recently cave and buy an A5 binder. And I moved my Stacy collection in there alongside some other like random photo cards. So yeah, I now have two A5 binders. So I'm definitely falling like down a hole right now. But like I bought this binder for a very specific reason but now I'm thinking about like other things I want to put in it so I don't know I'm just gonna go with it so first off okay so I have the actual binder which I'm gonna be adding a collection to well not adding just moving and then I have a cover page for this binder and then I have some dividers for my collections because I think I'm gonna need some of these and they didn't really have a big selection and this is like the one I like the most from the ones I could find so I just want that and then I have some one pocket refills, I got two of those, and then some two pocket refills. And I did actually get some four pocket refills in my last order. And I shoved them all into the binder, which is kind of dumb because now it's really bulky for no reason. But anyway, let's go ahead and set this one up. So I guess I can just start talking about what I want to do as I'm setting this up. So recently, I decided that, okay, I don't know what the right word is. I decided that I wanted to stop collecting Subin non album but I don't want to drop his collection I just want to like pause it for the moment <laughs> and it's so dumb but like I just really love him I don't want to like let go of his photo cards but I want to focus in on my collections a little bit more and I want to try and finish my take you collection before I focus on Subin because financially I can't do like all three of them at the same time so I just I don't know I feel like I have a lot going on in my collections right now it feels kind of like overwhelming I guess so I just want to like pause some collections but like not necessarily get rid of them because every time i get rid of a collection <laughs> i end up regretting it so much like straight after but yeah basically i decided i'm gonna make my tfc non-album binder for bongyu and taehyun because they're like tied for my ultimate buyers right now and then i'm gonna make this like my guilty pleasure open binder <laughs> that's what i'm calling it but while i was thinking about like collections that i feel like i want to pause i was also thinking that i want to pause my main collection and again, I'm not, like, I don't want to sell off all his cards. I just feel like I don't really have, like, the, like, I'm not really focused on his collection right now. Because I just feel like I have a lot going on in my other collections. But I feel like in the future, like, I could focus on him more. So I don't want to, like, let go of his collection. But I also don't want, like, collections in my main binders that I'm not really, like, focused on, if that makes sense. So, yeah, that's why I decided to basically move those out of the binder now the problem is i don't know if both of those collections will fit in here i might have to put one of them in like my stacy binder but i don't know i'm kind of all over the place right now so yeah here's this wait this one doesn't come with the oh my god this one doesn't come with the sleeves no i'm such a clown oh my god hopefully i have enough for this video we might have to double side some cards i guess we'll find out i guess good on me for um ordering a refill last time i guess i'm literally not gonna have enough sleeves to do this this is so sad i'm just gonna take all of these out and put them in here hopefully it's enough if not i will just double side some cards until i get some more okay it actually might be enough i'm being kind of dramatic also here's my stacy binder if you haven't seen it super cute it has a whole hair on it let me just put these sleeves in here hopefully it's enough that is so loud oh my god i think it just woke up my entire house i'm so sorry this video is a mess already like i didn't really come into here with a plan so oh my god this is about to be so loud anyway um yeah i didn't really have a plan coming into this so i knew it was gonna be a mess but i don't know it feels very chaotic at the moment so 
Let me find a little saloon card I can put here. Oh, also let me take this off before I forget. Okay, so here are the freebies that I have to choose from. I think this one's probably gonna match the best. But let's see. Yeah, because this one's so cute, but it just doesn't really match the colors. I think this is the only one that really fits in, so we're probably gonna go with this. He looks so cute in this anyway, like I'm not even mad at that. So let's just put him in here. Okay, that's really, really cute. I'm gonna decorate it later and like maybe sleeve it so it stays in place. But for now, that's really cute. And I guess now I'm just gonna grab my TXE binder and start taking stuff out. Oh my god, I'm so... Oh, I'm not mentally prepared for this. Okay, so here's my non album binder. I'm just gonna go ahead and like start taking out the souvenir cards. Oh, this is, this is like low-key painful, but like I gotta do what I gotta do. I just realistically cannot afford to collect all three members right now and it sucks, but like it is what it is. And yeah, I'm probably gonna like trade off. I'm gonna put my souvenir cards up for trade only to like cards I need for my collection, but I'm not gonna be selling them like I said. The only exception will be if someone has like a card I need and they want to trade. Um, I don't know what to do with these bigger things. I guess I'll just take them out. I did buy some like two pockets, so I think they'll fit in there. And I'm gonna do a time lapse like at the end if anyone cares of me like reorganizing this whole binder because it's gonna be a mess. But yeah, I actually have so many souvenir things because I was thinking he's gonna be like the hardest member to collect out of my top three. So whenever I saw this stuff, I would just like jump on it. So yeah, I did end up with a lot of souvenir stuff. Again, that's why I don't want to sell anything off. I definitely will pick up his collection again in the future. So I want to have his cards, like some of them at least. Okay, so for three pocket sized items, I'm just going to keep his cards in here because that way like it'll just fill up nicely. So yeah, I'm not going to take those out. And then I'm debating if I want to take these out or not. I'll take them out. And if I don't have the space for them, then I'll just like put them back in. Yeah, I'm just going to take them out for now. I think I just broke the sleeves <laughs> trying to take these out, but whatever. Yeah, we'll try and put them in the binder. If not, then we'll take them out. <laughs> and we'll take this out. And what else do we have? Okay, I'm going to keep the unit. I'm probably going to take this out and switch this over to a six pocket page like I had it before. Because I just like that layout better anyway. I think I'm going to keep this like this because it just looks so nice. Like, yeah, I'm keeping it like that. And then this one's gonna stay the same, and I think the rest of this is like OT5 stuff. So yeah, it's actually not as much as I thought. Okay, a little sneak peek at my next um, story photo cards video. Um, okay, yeah, I don't have any Subin in here. I'm getting some Subin stuff in a Neoki order soon though, but I'll just start that in my next photo card video, I guess. And while we are here, we might as well go ahead and take out my main house cards. This is so sad. I think I might selectively keep these. I don't think I'm gonna keep this unit. I don't know, I'll figure it out now. I'm just gonna go through and see, I guess. Okay, so here's my stack of 17 cards, and it's honestly a lot more than I thought it was. I don't even know if I have enough sleeves for like resleeving all of those, because yeah, I don't have that many, but we'll find out now, I guess. So I'm gonna start off with Supin, since once again, he is the main focus of this video. And the good news is that since I had these in hollow sleeves, they're already in the Japanese size um, Dragon Shield sleeves. I forgot what I was saying. So yeah, I just have to slip them out of these hollow sleeves. I'm gonna not put them in hollow seeds for this binder because, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even think they'll fit with the hollow seeds, so it's fine. Oh, I have to re sleeve this one. Okay, yeah, like I only have this many sleeves, so hopefully it's enough, but I don't really know. I also don't think I'm gonna keep every Minghao card, so maybe that will save me. Also, like, let me know what you guys think about the hollow seeds in my non album binder. Like, I'm kind of like on the fence about them. Like I like them, but sometimes I'm like, is it too much? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it's cute, so like I'm just gonna go with it. But yeah, should I just save my main hall cards and get it out of the way? Probably. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go through first and kind of see what cards I want to keep before. So let me figure this out.
Okay, so these are the cards that I'm gonna get rid of. It's honestly not that much, but with these, it's gonna look a lot nicer because the way I have it planned in my head, it's gonna look so cute. So I'm very excited. So let's find out if I have enough sleeves for this. I'm just gonna speed this part up. Okay, so everything's re-sleeved and thankfully I did have enough sleeves for everything. So now we can actually start putting stuff away, which I'm so excited for. Okay, so obviously we're gonna start off with my soothing section. So let me just grab my pile. I'm probably just gonna put them in the order I have them here. This looks about right. So I'm gonna do this. This is gonna be the page of all the like cute selfies. So like this. I'm just trying to balance out the white. I want this one on top because this is my favorite Subin card ever. I almost like don't even want to trade these away <laughs> like i don't know i just i really need to like help out my bungu and taegon collection but i just love subin so much like and these are all like concept cards i guess just put them like that like that yeah because it's the same concept why do like why does he actually have so many concept cards i mean i collect them anyway because i'm literally a clown for them but like if it was any other group i'd be so mad but yeah, there's that page. And then we, I'm here like, oh my god, we're not gonna have enough sleeves. And I literally only have like three pages worth of souvenir cards. I really thought. I do have like a lot more on the way from my Neokyo haul though. So <laughs> maybe that's why I thought I had so many, but we're not gonna talk about it. We definitely have enough sleeves. <laughs> I'm literally so dumb. Oh my god. This is literally backwards. So yeah, oh my god. <laughs> We have three pages of non-album souvenir cards and I was here freaking out. Anyway, let me now start putting in all of these things. I'm hoping they're gonna fit in these two pockets. I think I'm gonna need a bunch of them, so let me just put a bunch of them. Okay, but why is it so hard to open this binder? So yeah, I guess I kind of figured out that most of TXC's items are like bigger. So that's probably why I felt like I had way more than I actually did. We're just not gonna talk about it. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. Um, okay, I'm just gonna double side these because there's nothing really interesting on the back. So these fit in here so nicely. Like, hold on. I kind of did something here. Okay, and then I can put this one. Did I not take out his runaway broadcast? Oh, it's right here. Cute. It fills out so nicely. Oh, I love that. All right, so broadcast, and then what should we do next? Should we just tackle this? I'm just gonna put this here first because like I have it, I guess. Oh my god, that fits in so nicely. I love that. And I guess, can I put these like, is this gonna work? I mean, do we hate it? I feel like it's not terrible. <laughs> Hold on. Maybe if we put it like this. Like, it's kind of cute. Okay, I'm keeping it like that. I don't care. I feel like, okay. I'm just trying to convince myself that I like it, so I'm just gonna move on. <laughs> and I guess we can just put all these in now. I don't really love these in here, but I might take these out and like put them back in the binder because yeah, I just think they look nicer there. Okay. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna keep these in here. I just do not like how they look and I just know they're gonna slide around everywhere. But this page is cute and these are cute, so we can keep those in here. Yeah, oh my god, I hate this so much. I'm, I'm just gonna take these out. I'm sorry, we're not doing that. Okay, anyway, 
Now we can move on to the Ming Hao collection. And then we can put in one of these dividers, which again, I don't really know if I will, like, but it works for now. It's literally just paper, but <laughs> I mean, it's kind of cute. All right, so the way I have this planned out, it's gonna like perfectly fill out four pocket pages for all of it. I don't know, that's not the right words to use. <laughs> Basically, it's gonna look nice, so I'm excited. So I have the two AL1 Polaroids. And then I hope this fits in here. Okay, yeah, I didn't save it because I knew, I mean, I wasn't even gonna put in the save. So, oh wait, let me put teenage first actually. So yeah, that fills out that four pocket nicely. And then I have two You Made My Dawn cards and two You Made My Day cards. So it's a cute little moment for that. I had both of these, but I just decided to sell one. So this will look nicer. So yeah, that's what we're doing. These cards are so cute. Like how could I get rid of them? <laughs> I literally can't. I am not making the mistake of selling off my entire main home collection again. Like I regretted it so much the first time. Okay, this is gonna be the page of my favorite and old cards that I currently own. So all of these, I tried to like get rid of the ones that I had the same version for, but that would have made one pocket only have three cards. So I just decided to keep both of these because they're literally like both stunning. So it's fine. And now this one looks nice and cute. And then these are like the and old cards that like I could honestly like live without, but I'm just gonna keep them for now. Like, I might sell them off in the future if I feel the need to, but for now they can stay. Like, they're really cute, but they're not like my favorites, I guess. But yeah, there we are. Oh my god, why is my hair always on everything? Okay, there's that page. And then I have exactly four Hingari cards, which works out like perfectly. So I think I'm gonna do them like this. Cute, yep. Okay, cute. I like that. And then I have these two Minghao. Obviously, <laughs> obviously the Minghao. I have these two semicolon cards, which I'm just gonna keep both of them. I don't really know what I'm gonna do because your choice has three cards, and I don't wanna trade for them because I have the pulls anyway. But like, they're not gonna fit, so I don't really know. Also, I have these like family cards, and they're so cute, and I can't get rid of them. Like, you can't make me. But I didn't save them because again, I'm running low on sleeves, so I'm just gonna put them in here. Okay, yeah, so we actually have a bunch of pockets left over. I was being so dramatic for no reason, but I guess we can do a little flip through of what we did. So here's the cover, which will be decorated in the near, the near future. And then here's my little souvenir section. Very cute. Basically all non autumn things and some broadcasts and drama postcard and fan life stuff. And we're not putting in the fan life mini cards because Y'all saw how that went. <laughs> and then here we have my Minho downsize collection for right now. We might pick them up again in the future or we might just sell them off. We don't know yet. But for now. And some family cards. And yeah, oh my god, it's so cute. I'm really loving the mini binders. For the longest time, I was like, no, I'm not gonna get a mini binder. Like, my collections, like, they wouldn't look nice and this and that. And now I'm obsessed with them, so whatever. So for the next portion of this video, I'm just gonna be reorganizing my TXC binder. And I'm probably gonna just speed that part up since I have to do like too much thinking. And I don't do thinking and talking well at the same time. So yeah, I'm probably gonna do that. So if you're not down to watch that, thank you so much for watching. But if you are, I'm gonna insert that clip now.
Okay, so I just finished and I think I should probably explain what I just did because if you're watching this, you're probably like, girl, what are you doing? Like, I literally just changed out a bunch of sleeves and it probably made no sense without contact. Okay, so if it has a pink sleeve, that means it's on the way. If it has one of these like plain white sleeves, it means I don't have it on the way. And if it has like a hollow sleeve, that's just like a placeholder, like no cards are going there. So here's my eternity page. And yeah, I'm just gonna put these in the middle and then the lucky draws so that I can find them will go here. And then this is like my blue hour selfie page. So I have the Polaroids in the corners and then the with fans um, selfie and the Weaver selfie. And then here it's like the same thing, but with the concept. And then this is like my lucky draw page for blue hour. It's like a work in progress. And then here's my first freeze period of benefit page. So these are all the concept ones. So here's gonna go with the with fans. I, I'm saying with fans because I can't pronounce this and I don't even want to try. <laughs> so yeah, the first round is gonna go there because it's the same concept as this one. And yeah, that's what that's gonna look like. And then here are gonna go all the um, like selfie pre-order benefits. So the Lozada, Shopee, with fans round two and three. And I don't have my pulls for any of those yet, so I don't know what I have. And then I was so confused because I was like, I literally have one leftover pre-order benefit. Like, what am I going to do with it? And then I was thinking, I can just put it with my lucky draw cards because there's only six of them. And it's going to fit in perfectly with them because it's like the same concept. Kind of the neighbor one. It's like hollow and it's like the same outfits. So yeah, I'm just going to put them on the page with the lucky draws. And I think it's going to work out really nicely. So yeah, there's that. Um, Okay, yeah, this page. It's kind of sad now, but I do have another crown broadcast on the way, which is why I love that space here. And then my Japanese page, I'm gonna do the two drama ones here, and then the um, magic hour one here, so that's what I have going on here. And I don't have a space for the weeply ones, because like, I don't have any hope of getting those. And then here's my still dreaming page, so the standard, the UMJ, the Lopi, and the- I think I pronounced that wrong, but um, yeah, the Weaver's one will go here if I can find it. And then here are the little postcards. I just left the spot for Taehyun. And, um, yeah, here's this. Okay, here, it's kind of like a mix of random cards. So, I have this unit from the photo book. I have Taehyun and Mogi on the way, which is gonna go in the center, obviously. And then I want to try and get one more of Taehyun's units to put here, so yeah. <laughs> I'll get there when I get there. And then I have the DVD cards, obviously, and the season's greetings. And then I'm gonna do the um, Japan photo cards on either side, which I do have on the way. And this is basically gonna be like my fan life page. So I'm gonna have the card ticket here, and then the wow wow benefit or whatever. I don't even know what it is. And then I'm gonna have the um, Dream Week one on the corners. And then, yeah, obviously the states the same. I put all my Subins back in because they look terrible in the other binder. And the only other thing I changed is this. So this is where the last day will go and the Yeonjun and Hyunka unit if I could ever find it. But yeah, there's that. So yeah, oh my god, that was a long one. I mean, probably not as long for you guys, but I've been here for over an hour now. So that was a lot of reorganizing. <laughs> but I really am glad I did that like every morning to get that out of the way. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.